right? Yeah. If you look at like if you look at the milk, are you familiar with the Stanley Milk Milgram experiments, the ones where yeah. they gave fake electric shock? Okay, so this is an important uh, uh, trial, right? So back in the fifties, uh, um, psychologists were puzzling themselves, asking themselves, how could good, decent people in Germany have formed to such um, dark acts? as the Holocaust, right? It doesn't make any sense. So they came up with a series of ingenious experiments. And this one was a particularly twisted one. And, and I, by the way, after this experiment, they had to revise the entire code of ethics for psychology because of this experiment, right? Okay. So what he did was this. He had a actor sit in this very sophisticated looking room with lots of lecturers attached to him. And then they brought in a regular member of the public and they said, look, we're doing some research into learning and how punishment reward systems work with learning, right? Mm -hmm. What I need you to do is ask him, a, uh, there's a list of questions, ask him the question. When he gets the question right, he's good. If he gets the question wrong, we're testing on our punishment. You've got to give him a little electric jolt, you push his button, he gets a little electric jolt, and then you turn the volume up so that every time he gets a question wrong, the jolt gets worse and worse and worse, thereby motivating him more to get the questions right. At least that was the, the setup, right? Wow. In reality, the person in the chair was an actor. There's no electrodes attached to him. He just had, uh, he just had a little flashing light that tells him what the level's at, and he would act out a level of pain that was commensurate with the amount of, of shock he was supposed to be getting, right? So it's all an act. The, the, the test subject was actually the member of the public pushing the button. The question is, will they give someone a either a lethal or severely, um, uh, uh, would they would they be willing to torture someone or murder someone with electric shocks just because they were told by a man in lab coat to do so? Guess what? A shocking <clears throat> did it. In fact, some of them were so conflicted, they were literally in tears and trembling whilst they were giving someone what they thought was a potentially lethal shock. And this is a normal, average day, everyday person.